Alright, and we're back with Tiger Woods 06. So we're gonna be going against Hal Duff, and we are not up in the ante. Uh, let's get it. Home of the 98 PGA Championship, the Sahali. One thing I, uh... Please welcome our next golfer to the team. One thing I had never done was... So, you know how Jack Nicholas was already unlocked. Um... Ladies and gentlemen, oh god, this guy. That swing. I never actually like s would try to see if I could. S I mean, I guess you can just skip this guy and go straight to Jack Nicholas. Which is kind of weird. I think we got about a hundred yards left here. About a hundred yards with that wind. This should carry just fine, but it's left somehow. Even though the wind is 17 miles an hour to the right. Gonna have to rethink some strategy for this next one. I see the ball, oh and God. I see the sand, what is he doing? and Trying I to think chip it? soon you'll see the ball in the sand. <laughs> or back in the sand, if you will. Tough Jesus, break. man. May have to is he gonna take from here? 18 shots? For, no, he can't, but 12. But that's two. Is he gonna take 10 shots? No, okay. Should be a makeable putt after this one. Yeah, I think after Jack Nicholas, all we have left is Tiger Woods. Now I'm gonna try it again, okay? Try to fade it. Or, and look, it just went straight Still right. Seem to have much chance of staying in play. Are you kidding me? Out of bounds. All right. And hit a tree. <sighs> it's good to know that the. Uh, Cuts and draws and stuff don't work for you, but they work for everybody else, so it's nice. It's real nice. If it's in the rough, it's in the rough. Mm -hmm. Could be much worse, though. McCord, so much of this game is mental, you know that. That was just poor judgment. Another thing you're familiar with. Only reason I'm still even hitting the ball is because he's going to be hitting his fourth from right Hard there. This is if we can get away with a six. Some kind of vegetable. Which would need, he need to make a 30 foot the putt. Then we could possibly tie. <laughs> yeah, well, you got your name in the bag. Let's see how you can pull this off. Oh, pff, I don't know why I did that. Alright, so we're probably going to be uh, losing this hole unless he three putts, which he won't. That's going to hurt. That's a bogey. Good to know, don't try to shape a shot in this game, because it won't work. Oh, you know what? I just realized it's probably this stupid ball. That's the shape, shot shape. So, let's see. Nope, this just went straight this is right. What happens when a golfer loses <laughs> focus. <laughs> All right, we're done with that. All right, so rough wind 
in shot shapes and the height of a ball on anything above a six iron pretty much just don't work gotcha hard to stay in the short stuff but alas it didn't make it good to know not to use some of the mechanics that the game's supposed to have you know it makes the game more Should fun when you get here. to uh, play less of it yeah. why did anyone want to change the greens here they were fine the way they were Oh my goodness, it went in the hole! Yeah. Oh yeah, and putting is just janky as hell. Get out. Yep, I think you find some sand. That's just a wonderful shot. Left turn, right in. Back the one up, even though we well, should be. I mean, shoot, we should honestly be five. Just straight right. Got his work cut out for him from here. And we're gonna have to lay this up because again, can't hit a cut, can't hit a draw, so it's in the rough, but looks to be setting up quite royally. Mm-hmm. Here, my friend. Lots of work. Nice putt. Looking at a big birdie putt here. Huge. And it drops for birdie. Can't get over a swing to be honest. I completely forgotten about it. As most of them I remember, you know, you got Pops and Mo, you got Tsunami. Um Ace. Down. Oh, come on. Oh, not sure what happened there. Whatever. Nothing wrong with that par. All right, giant this jaw man. This will have the hole. God, do you see the <laughs> the jaws on this guy? They like popped out.
only I could aim right there. I could aim right here. Oh. I was thinking, you know, the 17 mile an hour wind would bring it a little bit right, but it didn't. Not even an inch. Crazy. That was perfect. Sit. Yeah, sit. Sit down. You got it right there, character. Well, we're gonna be putting, so it's not a bad shot. This is a birdie putt. Closer that would God, some in. of them have a, just insane break and the others that break just the whole Guess way there far. Just don't break as much as it would seem or really it's because you can only hit it You know a certain With a certain power so that doesn't really help either I guess Stick okay I was gonna go rolling back down. Couldn't have done that better myself. You probably knew that. Oh. I thought it was going more left, but Converts his par. Gets his par. Stop it. Stop it. Quit it with the frickin' things, man. God. It's so annoying. The animations for one don't make any sense because usually they're insanely delayed <laughs> Just like what they say they're like sit or you know get up or whatever it's after the after everything's done they, They'll say it or break break and it's all right the putt stopped. It's you're done And then they have a freaking 30 second animation that goes with it That's a good shot. Right, whoever was in QA was just like, eh, whatever. I don't care about it. It can go in. They didn't test it very well at all. Oh, way too long. Not over there. Dang it. Well, McCord, it's not position A, but uh, no. it shouldn't cause much harm. It's position B. Good, that's good yeah. I like B better. It goes in the hole. hole. See, he was in David, position A, and it just example. didn't go in. So. Whoops, what the hell did I do? Oh, I guess that just resets him. I was hitting triangle. I was like, what the hell is this? Yeah, you might need Tiger's A game to hit it here. It's about 280 to the hole. 280? Yeah. It'd be a stretch for me to get... Oh, I have my driver. Okay. Well, I guess we'll see how that does. Oh, this time I actually got more than f two feet off the ground. Surprising.
You're set up for a miracle putt now. Good luck. Good luck with that miracle putt. Uh, pitch is just way too far, man. Uh, Should be in good shape after this. All right, I'll take it. Looking to walk away with birdie on this hole. Very good putt. The birdie will help here. It usually, it usually does. does. Drops it for birdie. game breaker somehow this guy actually is way further than most of them are because he has a giant cut as well but his are actually going in the fairway sometimes I'll use mine on this shot I guess okay, with these conditions sound wedge is definitely the best bet uh, yeah I didn't get much of it, so uh, I don't know. Oh, I went in the hole. <laughs> Maybe it does help. Good thing I used it there, I guess. Let's see, 176. I'd be hitting my 7. There's 171 to the pin. It'd be a small 7, full with the wind, I think, in real life, I mean. Oh, God. I shouldn't have added the loft. Oh. And this would finish it. Well, that's his best shot and yeah, happened not on as easy as it seems here. The last hole. God, I hate that so much. Oh. Come on! Oh god, shut up, man. Converts his par. All right, he's got to make it to continue. Walk away with the hole. Miss it, Duff. Duff it. Yes. Not a good putt here. Another challenge. It's one of the best par five golfers who ever played the game and wants to challenge you to contest on multiple courses. No. We've done. We've already done a par five challenge with Tiger. And now we got Jack Nicholas. Why would you ever try to bank it off a tree in this game? It's so inaccurate w whether or not it's going to even go straight. Hello, everyone. I'm Gary McCord. Hello, Ladies Gary. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our next golfer to the team. Once we're done with Jack, we'll go ahead and do some more stats. Last player probably to this use wooden good. clubs, I would think. Hmm. We'll do the sandwich downhill. Power. Ah, I didn't go as far as Very I was hoping. Very far from the hole here. Wow! It this didn't come back nice left at all. From your opponent. Until after the hole, it's, it was breaking more left than right, so. So close. Makes his par. I'll say if we go one down on the first hole. On Mr. Nicholas this here. Half the hole. I'm the good player's going to make this putt. You, uh, not so sure, you but I'm rooting for you. Gary, get out of here. Calm wind 
on the last hole. I thought maybe since we were facing off against the ball, you know, Jack Nicholas, that it wasn't going to have the speed, it would just have the direction. And so it's a calm, so I figured there was some wind, like five or six mile an hour, something like that. But no, it's... Calm is basically no wind. Oh, oh. no. Anywhere so but that, here. That's another reason why I went down to the sand wedge, because I figured, oh, the, the five or six mile an hour wind will bring it up there, but... Come mm. on! But no, there was no wind. Well, this one had a real chance of going in the hole. This will win the hole. Go one up. Bravo! That's a well-played birdie. I have 596 yards. Well, the tee shot, it says it's downhill, but the tee shot's uphill. And once you get to about 290 yards, then it starts to go downhill. Well, I wasn't thinking I would, it would just shoot to the right. These bunkers are very challenging. Yeah, especially when you just nail it in there with the frickin' driver. Alright, he's getting that one close for birdie, so we need this one to go close, but unfortunately it's 200 yards. Which, as you all know, is right in my wheelhouse for making it six foot and under to the hole, you know? Should be able to make birdie here. Now, all of a sudden, Nicholas is shaking his boots where a foot from the hole. If he misses this, we win it, and he That's misses your it. birdie! Well, you know, he wasn't too nervous. This one for a half. Just a tap in. Rolls in the birdie putt. Well, luckily our match against Duff, even though we were actually one down at one point, lasted hardly any time. So I come back down. That's a good shot. So instead of it being like normally at this point in the match it's like almost a half an hour has already gone by, it's barely past twenty minutes, so that's good. Absolutely perfect shot. All right, downhill. Actually, not board. breaking very much. Oh, Possibly or at all. Dram would help you. Now again, we couldn't have. There was no way to go to the lower putt because it wouldn't have made it to the hole. So it's make it or go by eight feet. Unfortunately. Right. What do you know? It's in the rough. Going for the green. Now it is uphill. But the wind is on our favor. We got a good bit of power on that one. Got the height. Does it have the carry distance? It does. What a shot. Oof. This is definitely a makeable putt, don't you think? Uh, yeah. 
sanction yeah, for an eagle. Yeah, definitely. Hardest hole right here, 455 yard par 4. Well, it's downhill. There's a big old creek on the right side. That's probably why it's the hardest hole. But when you hit it 341 yards straight down the middle, it tends to be a little easier. Yeah, I knew it was going to come back. So yeah. I put the top spin on This for a second consecutive birdie. That was for birdie. And Jack this was in there close. So, the you know, if we didn't do it, then. That's what you want. Nice we were birdie. in trouble. You birdie, birdie, birdie. Uh, this course. Oh wow, Jack Nicholas game breaker is it's gonna be full after this hole. I'll have to see where mine's at. His will be full after the shot actually, so he'll probably drain ours. Um That's the way we like it. Yeah, so about yards to fly. Yeah, he drained it. I don't even know. Oh, we were almost there as well. We would have gotten it after this hole. But that's alright. His was drained because of that, so he's not going to be making any crazy shots. Ooh, I was going to say like that. Look where that one ended up. No chance. Sinks the birdie putt. And I guess the game breaker meter wasn't very popular. Ah, oh, I didn't get enough power. Not over there. Because they took it out immediately. Like, 07 didn't have it. 06 does. 05 didn't have it. So they implemented it in 06 and then took it out. This doesn't look good. You in 07. The lime accord. Oh. Should Ooh. be a makeable putt after this one. Tap it in and move on. This to have the hole. All right, can we get to four up before going to the back nine? We only have 105 yards left on our second shot. While Jack will have 143, not bad. That's a nice uh, full pitching wedge for me. Did somebody find my sand wedge? It might be a full pitching wedge. It might be too short for one. It depends. I do believe that that was a good choice of club. Fantastic approach. And yes, we get a four up going to the That's back. That's right.
Well, we can definitely go too far. So, not full power on this one. And a bit more when he plays out of this in the he's rough. In well, he's closer than us, but he's in the rough. Get up, get up. There we go. Oh, what a shot! This is oh, a, a good one from the rough. That's a nicely played birdie I there. I we might be going five up after that, but no. This for a half. Drops it for birdie. We got a short par four here, only 389. Right, we have ways to improve your power. But it's uphill. Actually, you don't. <laughs> Because I have full power. Oh no, I guess I don't have power boost full, so. About 140 left here. Well, Jack, you drove it past us. Ooh. I'm sorry, I hit this a little here. bit hard, but really it was just left. As is Jack's, but his is far more left. If you happen to be a sheep. Concentrate now. You can make this one. It's in! <laughs> Concentrate now. You can make this one. It's in! Calm it down there, buddy. It was like a 12 foot putt. Ooh, what a shot from 220 yards. That'll do it. I'll say Jack gets similar, but doesn't get quite the roll left that we got. This for four straight birdies. Got the birdie. All right, all we gotta do is tie on the easiest hole in the course, a 414 yard par four. That's downhill about 12 yards. Move the fairway, we have 73 yards to go. That would be a Three quarter lob, lob wedge for me. Uh, the fairway's over there. I found out last time I played that I, I hit the lob wedge full between 90 and 95 yards. So. Which is why I was getting so mad when I was hitting a loft wedge and I thought, I thought 75 yards was my full loft wedge. And I would hit it full at 70 to 80 yards. And it would go, you know, 15 yards past the hole. I just like, what's going on? You know, because you should be, you should be within 15 feet, no matter what, from that range. If you, you know, you practice a little bit with your, part. with your uh, pitches. And I was, you know, way over the green. No not, but this is for the match. In most cases. The perfect ace. What's that? So I was just thinking like, the yardage has to be wrong or, or you know, something. Cause I was thinking there's no way I can hit my loft wedge further than 80 yards.
Left the arrow. New era of golf. Tiger just wrapped up a devastating tour of the latter part of the 20th century golf world and is now en route to the present to warm up for the final time leap. Follow him to continue your quest to become the greatest golfer of all time. All right. And let's see, what do we have? Jim Furyk, Mike Weir, Ratif Goosen, VJ Singh, Jack Nicholas again. And then Tiger Woods. And we can go all the way to Jack Nicholas. So our rank. Our rank is one. Uh, defend your ranking five times before you can face down. Okay, so let's just beat these guys. Okay. Let's go to attributes. I think we actually have, yeah, we have a certain amount of experience for each one of these, which is actually, I noticed that last time. Um, that's pretty nice. It's like 24 and, uh, the approach, we have 4,435, probably... So weird that we, I don't get the, maybe hitting good shots from approaches and stuff gets you more and I haven't done too much. I have a ton for recovery. That could be because we're playing out of bad lies all the time. Not much in focus at all. So we can go equipment modifiers. Go with the driver. Power boost. Ball striking. Then with the wood. Ball striking. I guess we'll go with another ball striking. Don't really need the power boost for that. Ball striking. Recovery. Can't put two puttings. Okay, so then ball striking, I guess. I don't know. Power boost, ball striking, and recovery. Power boost, ball striking. Power boost, recovery. That's it. Recovery. Okay, it's just recovery. <laughs> Don't have any more for that. Oh, we have no more to use. Okay. Cool. What? I equipped it for the power, though. Oh, we only have one thing for power, maybe? Yeah. A lot for power boost. OK. 
Actually, that's going to be it for this video. But when we come back... Actually, let me check this out. Because we're almost done. What's this? Okay, so we do have some stuff that's automatically unlocked. But not like, not the players or anything. I'm trying to see which, because I don't want to play whole seasons. Because it would take years to get through all these golf games then. Whoops. Um, so yeah, we'll see what we want to do with that. So I hope you guys are enjoying it though. Have a great day and I'll see ya. Bye.